All right, everybody, we're back at CES again, and now I'm with uh, Isabella of Zybotics, and uh, just tell everybody what you guys are here for. Okay, so basically, this is Zybot, and Zybot is a robot that allows you to plug in your iPhone. If you have a 3GS, a 4, or an iPhone Touch, you can plug it into a base, and basically, you'll have a robot. There's two functions on it. One, it's remote control. If you download an app from a store, you can drive it around yourself. This is nice. Let's say you have a pet at home and you want to check on it. You can drive it around your house and use it. It's not like a web camera that's stuck in one location, so there's a lot of uses for it. Let's say someone's broken into your house, security purposes, you can follow the burglar and take a picture of them. The other application has is autonomous. This means it can drive around itself intelligently. It's not going to fall off your desk, it has a sensor in it, and it's not going to bump into objects. So it's a pretty neat little product. And currently, we're making it so that it can dance. We're putting an algorithm in. You can utilize the playlist from iTunes, and you can have it streaming through the iPhone. So when you're using it, does it act, does it work over 3G or do you have to be on a Wi-Fi network for it you to can, work? It has a lot of options. 3G is fine. You can also use Wi-Fi or Bluetooth. So distance isn't a problem. If you're in another country, you can still use this product. So um, is this already out in the market now or it's, are you developing it's still? It's not. You can go to zybotics.com is the website. It'll be released in March. So that's, and I believe there's a pre-order now currently going on. So how much is one of these docks going to run somebody? The current retail price is for $100. That's, that's not a bad price it's at all. It's so so something you can yeah. use a lot of things on. It's yeah. good. Um, so again, it's zybotics.com, right? Zybotics and the so. robot's Zybot. Make sure you guys check it out. And this is KT Data. More from CES coming up after this.